السلام عليكم ورحمه الله تعالى وبركاته بدا فنون في بودي دي من دي نادر نادر ليترز ودي في سيريس اوف ليرنينج انجليش ليترز اور ليسن فور دي از اباوت ابر كيس ان ان ابر كيس او سو ذس از ذس از ذس سلايد يو هاف ذا ليتر ان يو هاف ذا ليتر ان This is an overcase A. At the beginning, we will uh, try to learn uh, how to write the overcase A. Three steps to write the letter A. This is the first step. And this is the second and the third step. So, three steps to write the letter A. First step. This is 
f g h on j k l m and finally we have the letter n so this is the letter n in the second exercise or in the next one here we have match match the uppercase form of letter to the lowercase form of the same letter here we have a and this is the lowercase a the second one is the letter d and the lowercase d this is c and the lowercase for c n lowercase n so this is the uppercase n and the lowercase n and finally we have f lowercase f in this uh, first exercise here we have uh, some pictures this is the picture uh, of ovo and this is the picture of rabbit here we have an intro here we have uh, some numbers or numbers and finally we have uh, uh, eyes scale now we uh, at the beginning we uh, should put uh, thick or cross uh, the diamond to show a word uh, which begins with the letter N so I'm going to pronounce these words and we should select the uh, two or plus for each picture this is the uh, image of oven oven so it doesn't uh, begin with uh, N so we put cross in the second picture here we have rabbit right? rabbit so also it doesn't contain or begin with N the third one uh, is igloo igloo also it doesn't contain or begin with net the second one we have numbers so net numbers net so yeah this picture or where begins with net we would tick more the last one is for ice scale also it doesn't uh, begin with uh, in now my lovely students we should uh, write each word uh, under it so the first uh, picture for oven the second one is for rabbit the next one is for igloo the next one for numbers for numbers the last one is for ice cake Oh, 
this is an uppercase O and this is the starting point of the letter O so we begin from this point and like this from this point and like this so now I'm going to trace this letter notice I begin from the from this start going from this going and in the form of a circle in this way in this in the other exercise here we have uh, some pictures where it's of the little O here we have the uh, picture of Olive so we have O Olive O Ostrich O Octopus O Orange O O All of these pictures is a picture words of the letter O Each word begin with the letter O The sound of the letter O is O The sound of the letter O at the beginning of such words is O Now we will uh, identify some picture with the O at the beginning each word. This is the picture or the image of orange. This is the image of orange. So, orange. The word orange begins with O. And uh, these are another pictures of words with O. This is an octopus. Octopus. And this is an oven. Oven. And this shape is oval. This is an oval shape. This is circle, and this is triangle, and this is an oval. Oval. Circle and triangle. Now, this exercise here, we should try. Uh, the little O in the squares. So we have O dot oval. Each of these squares it begins or contain the little O. Now, now uh, we should match each picture, uh, each picture to the suitable uh, word. Here we have a picture of uh, an octopus, and this is uh, oval, and this is all. This is a picture of onion, and finally here we have an orange. In the next uh, exercise here, we should try to trace the little O. So this is the uppercase for uh, uppercase O and so on in this, uh, in this exercise then we have some pictures uh, again uh, with the O at the beginning of each wave here we have the, the image or picture of uh, Olive Olive O Olive and this is the picture of uh, uh, ostrich also it begins with O this is octopus and orange O and uh, this is the little O in the last exercise here uh, we uh, should uh, set in each uppercase O with the uh, blue. So we should uh, search for or look for the letter O in this chart. Here, in the first line, we have the letter O. And this is another one in the second line. In the third line, here we have another uh, uppercase O. And in the last line, you have another form of the letter O. Uh, now, as for the homework uh, of the letter uh, O, uh, again, 
you should uh, trace the local O and so forth then write the local O of these other three lines and finally fill spaces with the local O to get the uh, uh, complete words here we have for example O we get the word orange